Good Wednesday, everyone. I'm meteorologist Dave Snyder at the National Weather Service with Alaska Statewide Weather. Some changes coming to the northwest coast as fog and colder air dropping southward out of the Chukchi Sea starts to move inland. Areas of fog have been seen along the Yukon and Kuskokwim Valleys throughout the day today. And warmer air not really making a surge northward anymore as low pressure stalls out in the Gulf at 1,010 millibars, a weak frontal boundary moving eastward, bringing some showers and more clouds to parts of southeast as we go through our midweek day. Day. Areas of fog across the Bering, high pressure south of Attu and Kiska at 1,032 millibars, keeping more of a west and northwesterly flow crossing through the central and eastern chain. And the Aleutians, where winds will be picking up as we head into tonight and tomorrow. Many areas along the coast there along the Alaska Peninsula and the eastern chain, looking at the opportunity for small craft advisories. As colder air drops into the YK Delta, watch for more clouds and showers as we go in through tonight. The winds will tighten up a little bit more from the Pribilovs to the Alaska Peninsula. Kodiak still looking mostly dry with more clouds than anything else. Some showers across Prince William Sound turning into a better chance of rain around Yakutat and the northern parts of the southeast coastline. Showers also line up along uh, the eastern part of the Gulf, including the coastal sections of southeast, with a better chance of rain north of the Yukon and the Brooks Range, looking for an opportunity for snow that may mix in with a little bit more of rain and snow as we go into Thursday afternoon. Frontal boundary dropping southward along the Brooks Range will stall there as we head through Thursday afternoon. A 1,002 millibar low sitting across Arctic Village and just north of Fort Yukon will trail a trough of low pressure across south central Alaska, keeping more of a northwesterly flow going from McGrath to points west and Norton Sound and spot showers across the mountains and hilltops across south central and the Chugach Range. Showers and areas of fog will continue for the coastal areas of the Arctic with high pressure settling things down by Friday at 1,021 millibars. Look for an onshore flow around Prudhoe Bay, Dead Horse, and Kaktovik, and a little bit more drier pattern for the Chukchi Sea coast out toward Kotzebue Sound. A front will drape across the Alaska Range, keeping a northerly flow going through the central and eastern interior. A better chance for rain for South Central on Friday, and rain starts to fill in a little bit more by the end of the week for southeastern Alaska, with high pressure large and in charge across the central part of the chain and most of the Bering Sea. With Alaska Statewide Weather, I'm meteorologist Dave Snyder. Find us online anytime at weather.gov.